like uh, not to put you on the spot. There were two people, at least, who addressed the fact that there was a town hall meeting at the old Volley's the Blue Star Mothers Hall. Would one or each of you tell the councilman what took place? When they don't want the same thing to happen again. Okay. When we attended the meeting at the Volley's Hall, which I'm aware you weren't at, right. um, after the meeting, we spoke to them and we brought them over to the block. And they all agreed that there was a very big problem there. Right. And that's something. Who, who is they that agreed? You know, I'm sure. I'm sure the. I'm sure the town hall meeting was Senator Golden's. I mean, Senator Golden doesn't fix the streets, so I'm, I, I'm not going to lay this on him. But no, it was some. It was a woman, if I'm not mistaken. I believe Marty was there that night. It was a, a woman from. The uh, Was it the brass? Well, I'm not. I'm not. My husband said the other day to me when I was at work. There was an inspector from the DEP down there. Yeah, and he probably turned around and said it's DOT's problem. Well, yeah, that's exactly the, what, what I Just know. understand the distinction is we are going to have a joint inspection. DEP and DOT are coming down together. I'm not exactly sure of who we're, we're talking to at DEP, but I know at DOT we're talking to the Borough Commission. So, uh, Commissioner Palmieri. So, you, you know, th they understand that we mean business and, you know, that you know, they, they both tried the same thing. You know, it's their problem, and you know that was the you know the first couple of days of this. That is, you know, we're not going to accept that as an answer. Um, we we expect them to tell us what needs to be done, and then we're going to expect them to do it. Um, now, whether it's a quick fix, I don't know. Maybe this may be a real mess. You may have to dig up the street, rebuild the sewer. Uh, you may may have to live with a considerable inconvenience to get it fixed. But we'll let you know what the deal is. And then we'll decide what we want to do and, if, you know, make them do it. What is the A sanitary no. sewer? It's not That's sanitary. Not it's sanitary. not. Because I have to be honest with you. We never had this problem before they, they built the street and resurfaced it. We never had that problem. I don't. Or I couldn't. Sewers go right into the creek. I yes. couldn't. That's the difference. Yeah. Because I, what is the sewer that's? I couldn't, the I couldn't tell you guys what the difference. Do, but this is a storm sewer. It's a storm sewer. Let's keep it to. I I could not. I could not tell you what the difference between a sanitary. I never even heard the term sanitary. Sanitary sewer is your sewerage going into the plant. You flush your toilet. Right. Okay. Flush the toilet. That's and that's, that's just right. sanitary. And the other ones are storms which go into the water, go into the river. Right. We don't have storms, separate storms that go to the plants here. But Joey, the, 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 the square ones at the end of the block are storms. <laughs> Anything that takes in a rainwater yes. storm. They, all I can tell you is what they told us, and I'm sorry I didn't hear the letters. <coughs> they don't even know themselves, Luke. Yeah, well, that's why they got to come down here and look. They don't. And, know. and they're gonna they're, they're gonna look, and because you know we sent them the pictures. I mean, you you can't. You can't argue with that, you know. I mean, you know, I, occasionally we have ponding conditions on a block, and you know, they come down and they say, "Well, you know, we observed and da da da." The ponding went away in 48 hours. Not a problem, you know. We're not going to do it. This they couldn't argue with, so they, they're going to have to do something. Yeah. Listen, I just came out of my house. I live on Frank Gordon. I have three inches of water right now mm -hmm. in front of my house. Okay. Three days. All right. It didn't rain today, did it? You want to go over and look at yeah, my house? First time. Yeah, look you, at her house. You, you, look at her house. Sir, you, you don't have to convince. Okay. You don't have to convince me. Okay. I, I've seen the pictures. All right. I mean, the same day that you know I saw the pictures, we started making these phone calls. So you're preaching to the choir here. I mean, what, all I'm saying is, I don't know. I'm not an engineer. I don't know whether DOT's right, whether DEP's right, whether they're both wrong. But all I know is they're the two agencies that are responsible here. And they will be here together next week to inspect the conditions here to figure out what must be done to correct a problem that they both acknowledge exists, even if they don't acknowledge whose responsibility it is. Do you have a confirmed date, time? That's no, I just told you I don't have a confirmed date or time. I have a letter from them saying they will be here next week. All right, they will do it jointly next week. I have a letter from both DEP and a letter from DOT both saying that. Okay. Is there a number that can be called if they do not show up? This is nine years that they called. Uh, slow, slow down. You know, <laughs> you got to know that nobody makes a promise to me and then doesn't keep it all right, without hearing from me. 
All right, so I'm going to expect to hear from DEP and DOT by the end of next week that they have been here. Even if they say to a councilman, we, we've been here, we're studying it, we'll have an answer for you next week. But you can be sure. You can go to bed tonight, put your head on the pillow, and know it's guaranteed that we will follow up with DEP and DOT next week to make sure they got here and, and that, and that they, they took this seriously and that we get answers. Guaranteed. Okay? okay? I mean, you know, unless lightning strikes me. <laughs>